Like kama kama sponyo ataki wewe na kama ana pesa. Kutfanya aje. Alishtuka. Ongea na Kizaidi ukasema. So hii ni hii ni utamu. Kwanza kwanza nikisikia mtu ananisikia. Si 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 shock straight away na acha tu wamaliza yote wasema kila kitu alafu ndio na watch tour. Hello hello na karibu sana to my YouTube channel mwanza kama uja subscribe please consider subscribing because a lot more is coming Tim Kyoko udaku haitaki uzembe uko mahali hakuna wifi na una una credit ya kubai bundles ingia kwa mpesa yako pay bill ni 936936 account number ni namba yako kumbuka ni all networks Airtel Telkom Safaricom ile kitu kupo unajua ni nini bro ikiwa una pesa kwa mpesa usitense unafuliza mtu wangu unafuliza una buy credit una buy bundles una watch video zangu zote pay bill 936 936 account number ni namba yako ya simu niko maeneo fulani nikicheki nipo nyumbani hapa ni machakos country bus nilikuwa nafanya kazi hapa kitambo lakini nikasema you know what because somebody special amefika kutoka Eldoret kupitia mabasi za hapa nikasema lazima nikuje nimtafute tupige story tujue itakuwa vipi and of course this episode has been sponsored by Gradico Properties Africa Limited wenye kona mashamba maeneo ya kidhimani mala na pia maeneo ya malindi quarter uh, quarter an acre maeneo ya malini goes for only 150000 Kenya shillings na 50 by 100 maeneo ya kidhimani ni only 320000 Kenya shillings namba iko hapo chini ukitaka kuwekelea deposit just call gradico properties and it will get you sorted kama wana fanya ile kitu mzee angali eh hey, mzungu mwitu mahindi ni ya nini mzee adi mahindi ni ya nini so ni ya kukula kwa nini ya nini so unafaa ukule sasa mahindi kila mahali sasa kwa kwa choma kwa siaga lazima mahindi kulwe <laughs> kabla salamu kabla everything hapa kuna kitu tunafanyanga nyatangwa kupiga luku kama na tuanze pale kwa kiatu sasa niko na viatu kiks kenya atu viatu ya kiks kenya hii maluku ingine naweza semi ni amutush lakini itakuwa ni nakodanganya eh ukoje bro lakini mimi niko fit sana niko fit sana eh country bus unafanya nini mzee sasa hii ndio dege Unajua unaweza travel na ndege lakini saa zingine yeah. ni poko travel kwa barabara. Yeah. Yeah. So umekuja na gani? Unaona ndege yango iko hapa. Eh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you to miangi basi bro. Unajua hata sijui mimi shida ni nini. Unajua sijui unaingia kwa hewa unaanza ku Eh, badala ukai kwa barabara hata kama ina bounce, unajua ni nini ina bounce. Huko kwa hewa ni ujui una bounce nini. Eh. Yeah. Yeah tutumia barabara. Eh. Yeah. Waje yeah. watu watakuwa wamepanda matatu maybe waseme hiyo mzungu amesota nini ana pesa. Yeah. Kwa ni matatu ya kusota. Yeah. Ah, matatu ni poa, matatu ni poa. Yeah. Yeah, si ya kusota. Yeah. Ni ni preferred transport system. Yeah. 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 Si tunajua uko based Eldoret. Yeah. Shughuli umekaa gani hapa Nairobi? Um, Nairobi, ah, Nairobi. Nairobi nakuja sana sana kupiga kazi, interviews kama hiyo. Um, hustle hustle kidogo and i think hata fans fans wangu i think karibu wote wanatoka nairobi eh hey, nairobi hakuna wale wa doret hey, sijui hata kama awapigi hata 1% 1% hata ugiangalia hata kwa insides hata 1% hakuna nairobi ndio base eh hey. okay so mleletea nini jua naona nakula kama ana umepata hii mahindi bus tuzumie mahindi imeiva mzuri nikatie piece kidogo ni ume Acha kukula moja moja. Ama utamu wa njugu ni moja moja. Ukula utamu wa njugu ni kukula moja moja. Si ndio? Eh. Sawa sawa. Kama nani yake hii? Yake hii mzuri. Tumbili shika hii. Usikule mzee. Usikule mzee. Eh? Atakula. Unabeba mtu mahindi alafu unasema usikule ila zima kule weka kwa mfuko lakini usisahau tupige nyumbani tushtuke hii nini kwa mfuko kitambo tulikuwa tunakanga hapo tukienda shule unaweka hapo alafu wakati mwalimu anaendelea kufunza kamoja 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 bado si mayai mayai ukiweka mfuko ukisahau eh mimi ni wewe fanyikia eh aje ile ile 
Ato nilaenda unajua mimi mimi nilikuwa mluia kutoka nikiwa mdogo hata uko ngambo nilikuwa na kuku sasa unaenda unafika home from school unaenda kuchukua mayai unaweka mfuko alafu unafika jikoni unaweka weka moja nilisao naenda kukaa nimekalia mayai kaja kukaa yolo kakakuchafua eh ile yoko ya yolo kakakuchafua eh hata sikufungua unajua nilikuwa mdogo hii sikutaka giviboko nilifunika tu nilihang Eliza hivyo. Eh. <laughs> Sasa acha tuanze story mzee. Uh, recently ulikuwa UK and we all know that you have a youth initiative ya kusaidia vijana wenye kona talent. Shughuli zilikuwa gani UK na ulikuwa umeenda na nani na ulikuwa umeenda for how long maybe? Eh, so tulienda like around um, three weeks basically uh, kazi yangu ya ukweli. Unajua content ni ka side hustle. Um, so niko na NGO inaitwa Noah Initiative tunasaidia boy child. Unajua kwa dunia ni kama tumesao tumesao bavelana kidogo um, alafu through that organization tule kuna vijana watatu wale form band na itwa sovereign band um, so wamekuwa a bit big waliitwa UK tour tulienda tulechapa mashows huko ilikuwa ilikuwa poa eh. so ni wana wa manage eh mimi ndio manager pia mimi ni baba so tunasema ni dadja dadja manager dad combined <laughs> ni Mungu anasaidia. So vijana wako wako Eldore tama wako wapi? Eh uh, saizi wako Eldi. Um, but tunakwanga to all of the places. Kama kuna show anywhere tunaenda. Um, but nyumbani base ndio Eldi. Eh uh, nyumbani so umejenga Eldoret? Yes. Eldi ndio home. Eh uh, wakati ulikuwa na travel kwa basi. Mtu mlikuwa mnaenda eh mlikuwa umekaa na yeye kwa kiti moja because saa hii watu wanakaa pamoja si kama wakati wa covid. Ilikuwaaje safari? Ni poa of course watu wanashtukanga but wanazoea tu bado wanashtuka rangi kidogo alafu maisha inaendelea ni rangi tu ukinikata bado ni damu zemu <laughs> eh, but ni fit ni fit wewe shtuka sasa so gari ni akila mtu wewe wewe kukuza mtu lazima niingie eh ukiongea kiswahili watu react aje wanajua nowadays imekuwa less because at least watu wananijua jua but watu wana, bado wanashtuka like hata wanashtuka like hata kitu yenye inanishtua sana ni mtu akinijua so yani wana, wanajua kama mlami mwitu wanajua naongea Kiswahili alafu bado wananizengenya na Kiswahili wakifikiria it's like sasa wananizengenya na unajua ni mimi sasa unafikiria aje but i think wakili aingia i click like an, ninaelewa so inakuwa ngi hivyo tu eh. the worst thing wenye mtu ashike kusengenya ni nini ukisikia Hey, unajua mimi si catch feelings lakini the funniest ilikuwa sijui ilikuwa dem na kijana walikuwa nyuma yangu sijui kijana alikuwa anaambia dem ongea na huyu sponyo sasa mimi nasikia sasa nikifika kwa gari au bado wako nyuma yangu niliingia kwa gari na nilisema tu na kama huyu sponyo ana pesa na kama hakutaki hey wale alafu ninaenda tu na nacho tu na hiyo bomb adu lesema aje like kama kama sponyo ataki wewe na kama ana pesa kutfanya aje wale shtuka ongea na kizaili ukasema eh so hii ni hii ni utamu kwanza kwanza nikisikia mtu ananisikia si 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 shock straight away na acha tu wamaliza yote wasema kila kitu alafu ndio na watch tour ina ni fraisha sana ni fun ni fun by the way eh hiyo ni fun sana joka mimi ni joka live live full sasa hata kama unanizengenya bado lazima ni joke eh so do they affect you ama una uko tu sawa nazo ya kunisengenya I think nikikuja uh, the first time ilikuwa inani afe, but lakini I sijui sijui niko na tuna skin thick kama ni nini like hata mtu aliuliza juzi like what's the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to you and I'm like hey hata si get embarrassed like I'm one of those people hata unaweza kuwa tu cartoon na uski so hey, but simba simba si shtukangi uh, recently you posted a a photo pale Instagram ya ya watu wako unfortunately ukawa picha ukawa feature sura zao why um unajua si kwa ubaya na i think sana sana watu wa amin kitu mbaya lakini like um there was a time like for example watu walikuja paka shule kuniangoja yaki yani wali, waliona watoto waliona wakiingia shule wananingoja kwa shule you know like so safe sana it's not good for them um na unajua hii fem unaweza sema ni fem ni pressure yangu si pressure yao so lazima ni nichungulie hawa eh, eh. lakini kuna fan ali ali ali, ali respond pale 
akasema oh sijui nini unawaficha na ushaionyeshana na story mingi sana okay unajua saa zingine niko na mdomo mbaya but mimi na napenda wazi wasikoe wajuaji yani watu wanafikiria wanajua maisha yako kushinda wewe so kama mimi na, na moko kuonyesha watoto wangu ama kuficha so ni watoto wangu wewe niambia eh <laughs> but unajua hiyo response ilileta uh, mixed reaction sana eh. sio kama uliona yeah but ni sawa tu like watu wanaweza fikiria vile wanataka um, at the end of the day ni watoto wangu nitawaficha alafu watu i think kuna mtu karibu sana mtu mjinga but <laughs> nimeshasema like alisema like sasa unafita kwa social media lakini tunakuona kwa life it's like sasa unataka waivai like why is it mask kwa real life so i think unajua social media ni free for all kila mtu anaweza sema kitu anataka wezi wezi kataza but but ni live tu lazima mu deal nayo sasa zingine uko safe sasa zingine uko safe kama leo nimetembea na mzito mwenyewe anaitwa Simba. Wacha kuja hapa. Wacha Simba kuja na sura ya kazi. Hako na sura ya kazi. Ah sasa na smile. Uh, Simba eh hey. endelea. Uliba bodyguard wenyewe. Itabidi. Hey. Itabidi ni ibe. Unajua hey. <laughs> Simba team fanya interview na mimi hey. najuanga ni bodyguard wa Pluto. Hey. So uh, uh, ni kama yeye ni official bodyguard ya content creators. <laughs> Eh eh so umetoka na Eldoret. Ah tu, tumepatana hapa. Eh yeye amekuja kukujia. Eh hii ni watu wa Nairobi ni kuna wengine wa LD. Oh. Eh kwani uko na ngapi in total? <laughs> watatu ama ni wawili? Wa, watatu. Eh watatu. Eh uko na uko na uko na pesa hapa umebeba? Mm. Uko na pesa umebeba cash? Si bebangi pesa. Unabeba nini? Mindi choma. <laughs> Uh, some negative comments okay. kama hiyo imesema hapo na huyo mtu amesema amesema uko na shida. Tai ni kuna shida mingi. Mingi. Hakuna mtu anaweza kosa shida. Eh, ni kuna mashida. Kama gani? Eh, ana okay, anasema mini royal family. Hata royal family wako na mashida so unaona vile wanapigana saa hizi sijui wana nini. But um mashida mashida ni live tu. So hata hii Kenya tumesema yeah. kwenda kuchukua watoto shule alafu watu wanakongoja ni nini nini. Alafu pia watu wanafikiria likes. Likes sio pesa. Like unajua mtu anaweza uko na 1 million views. Lakini si automatic pesa. Ni life ina bado bado hustle ba, lazima ungangane. Eh. Uh, how do you respond to comments? I mean to online trolls? <laughs> kusema ukweli i think nimefaulu sijapata ma trolls mingi na mimi nina wa block tu hata sijibu ni block archive delete um, i don't deal with them i don't give them the time of day um, but na no, unajua no, kama nimesema niko na mdomo mbaya nikiamoko bom mtu hey wanaweza nitolea instagram sasa wacha ni wacha ni wa block strike kutusi mtu online <laughs> utonifukuza kenya <laughs> Okay, tukimalizia ningependa tuzungumzie siasa kidogo. Unapiga kura wewe? Siwezi piga. Bado sina sina citizenship ina ina iko in process hizi. Uh, but yeah. Siwezi piga mtu this time. So next time unaweza pata hata pengine ni na run sijui. For president. Ai, wacha nianze na sijui mtu aliniambia ali MCA, wacha nianze na governor yon. Governor. Yes. Governor. So ni the governor ya Western. Western you count again you know atuna semwe ni mulia si basi simama kwa waluya eh so ana hata hata i think the first question i was ever asked is uh, like una samamia kiti gani western so what ni what ni simama uyu so bora ni party citizenship ni leza run eh yeah. hey, what next time itakuwa 20 2027 2027 malami muitu kwa ballot unaona aje abu guys what do you think malami muitu akiwa kwa kwa ballot 2027 hebu tukutana hapo kwenye comments ballot sema ballot si ballot oh ya muluya ni ballot so ukisema hivi usahihi ukiulizwa kama ungekupiga kura nani fifth wajakoya eh kwa nini wajakoya okay sio serious but i think i sijui i think kila mtu ako na ideas nzuri kila mtu ako na ideas mbaya at least wajoko wajoko ni fresh eh uh, nimesema hiyo ndio difference yake but si kama ni nam vote siwezi vote lakini kama 
Pengine wajakoa yanga ichukua. Eh. Because uko na Simba hapa. Allow me to ask you one question eh. eh. Juzi uh, juzi kuna story imekimbia sana ikisema kana mnajua na Pluto kwanza? Ah uh, tujawahi kutano. Uh, uh. But let me ask you about, utanipia tu your view. Eh. Imekuwa ikisema kana Pluto ana mistreat girlfriend wake Felicity, amongeleshi na heshima, ampeleki date, ampeleki out ni nini mambo mengi. What do you think about that? Kitu yenye mimi ndio kuambia hao watu. So yeye yeah, wewe una complain yeye yeah, apeleke girlfriend yake out kwani wewe ni girlfriend yake so ni kazi ya girlfriend yake ku complain wacha kuingilia kile mtu akona maisha yake kile mtu apambane na hali yake mtu afagie kwake eh yeah. sasa kama kama dem ana shida sasa wewe uko na shida gani wewe si huyu dem eh yeah. sawa sawa tukimalizia ongea na mafans basi ah uh, imekuwa malami mwitu hapa nimefurahi sana kukuona um, uko fit hapa and paka next time make sure you like subscribe channel zangu pia channel zake asante oh, channel ni eh kuna channel a channel okay see channel but my handles uh, the reverend dad akm zai instagram tiktok facebook twitter to kila mahali eh sawa sawa asante sana kula mahindi uma mahindi mara moja uma mahindi kama ana nataka hapo video ukikula mahindi <laughs> But you are so funny. Siku jaka muko fani hivyo. You so funny. Kuna mtu ashikwambia? Mimi nasema tu vitu wenye ninafikiria. Na inatoka funny sijui kwa nini. So tukima uh, thank you so much for your time. Ukitoka hapo unaenda wapi nikufuate? <laughs> thank you so much guys. <laughs> So thank you so much guys for watching. Imekuwa nikipiga story na Reverend Dad Mulami Mwetu, Mzungu Mwetu. Majina ni mingi. Mzae. Wanyonyi. Wanyonyi. Wana kuitwa wanyonyi. Eh wanyonyi. Hata nikipata ID ya Kenya lazima niweke wanyonyi. Eh. Utaeka zako. Nini? Ndio niweka zangu alafu wanyonyi nyuma. Eh. Thank you so much guys for watching. Pale nyuma ya kamera si mingine ila Hans Kana 254 kijana ya mapenzi. For now. Sa bye bye.